Hi, Assalamu alaikum. In this video, we will understand about how fasting or intermittent fasting uh, can reverse the gray, uh, premature gray hair. So, how it can be occur in this video, we will understand about the logic and we will understand about the sense. So, number one thing is that the, when you will go into the fasting, so your body will be uh, go into the starvation mode. And in this way, the those cell which that is damaged will lead to apoptosis. So the remove of the damaged cell. But the uh, for example, the melanocyte produce the melanin, and in this way, the melanin is used for the darkening of the hair, the color, the pigmentation of the hair. So we will also understand about the uh, cell. Basically, is the cell during the fasting state. So the cell will go into the starvation mode and in this way the cell will survive and work properly because the AMPK pathway activation which that will lead to survive the cell and normal product and normal protein synthesis because it is the uh, is, it is the physiological stress during the starvation mode and that will lead to survive the melanocyte and function well. On the other hand, the fasting is too much important which that will uh, uh, decline the insulin level because when you will not eat, it means the insulin will drop. So when insulin will drop, so the growth hormone, so the growth hormone will spike. When growth hormone will spike, it will target to the adipose tissue to lipogenesis, uh, lipolysis, sorry, not lipogenesis, lipolysis due to the, the hormone sensitive lipase enzyme activation due to the growth hormone will produce more free fatty acid and glycerol go into the liver and it will process through HMG-CoA reductase enzyme will produce the cholesterol and cholesterol go into the testes and to produce more testosterone and dihydro testosterone which that is too much important for the darkening and the health of the hair due to the dihydro testosterone and uh, basically also part of the deep voice and the masculine look like a uh, masculine not feminine but masculine and decrease the fat in this way basically the uh, testosterone is too much important that is released from the more uh, during the fasting time that is the fasting uh, process intermittent fasting so remember that thing this is the another things and the ketogenesis will occur will provide the more efficient energy to the melanocyte will work proper and your skin will glow etc so all things will be pro proper functioning but this is a, uh, another thing basically the survivor of the melanocyte and the function well due to the starvation mode but whenever you will eat more and more again and again chronically which that will lead to activate the all cell the mTOR pathway this mTOR pathway activate due to the energy rich nutrient rich condition which that will lead to proliferate and in this way it will lead to damage the cell because it will lead to progress and the protein synthesis and replication of the cell but the DNA repair will not occur rather than the AMPK pathway is important for the DNA repair and the survival of the cell and longevity of the melanocyte and activate the longevity gene. It means that it is anti-aging when you will uh, work uh, with the fasting so the fasting is the anti-aging remember that things. In this way remember one more important thing is that whenever you will not eat so this is the important thing you should need to understand when you will not eat it means your uh, uh, digestive system will be a uh, relax your digestive system will prepare for the again food intake so further uh, again uh, whenever you will eat uh, after the fasting when you will break the fast so what will be happen in this way remember that things the digestion of the nutrients like trace mineral vitamin and the um, food like protein amino acid absorption require the enzyme in the digestive system like lipase trypsin chymotrypsin and on the other hand the pepsin uh, and a lot more lipase and uh, pancreatic lipase which that will prepare during the fasting time when you will prepare the enzyme so whenever you will intake food but the healthy food which that should be a contain prebiotic and probiotic in this way digest well and absorb well in this way assimilation will great 
but remember that things the microbiome will also grow due to the fasting and in this with the waste which that further more convert into the uh, helpful nutrient like vitamin k vitamin e as well as the short chain fatty acid and a lot more minerals and nutrients can be absorbed through a microbiome so the gut flora are present in the large intestine and cecum is the important region where the microbiome develop and use for the fermentation of the starch which that is based and in this way you all nutrient will be consumed and in this way you your body physiology will work properly and this is the fasting is important things which that will lead to increase and in this way when you will eat healthy food which that's contain prebiotic and probiotic prebiotic and probiotic is important for the uh, for the uh, growing of the healthy microbiome the bacteria which that are present in our gut which that is healthy and give the health of our brain so the fasting also decrease the depression the fasting also decrease the anxiety and depression and stress because it is antioxidant fasting also important for the clearance of the oxidative stress and the hydrogen peroxide fasting also important for the muscle growth fasting also important for the hair growth and the fasting also important for the normal physiology of your body and you will you will feel very healthy because your adipose extra adipose tissue will degrade is known as a lipolysis lipolysis will occur and the extra cholesterol will be used during the after the fasting the when you will break the fast so the bile production will more increase so emulsification of fat will increase more all these things is the nutrient related and the nutrient sufficiency in your body which that for example contains zinc and magnesium on the other hand the iron and the other trace minerals like uh, uh, copper which that is important for your normal health of your hair so overall body will be healthy it means your premature gray hair will be stopped it can be reversed you should focus on the anti-aging process and you should concern with the anti-aging process so ultimately your premature gray hair will be reversed so that is tough uh, challenge for you but you should adopt yourself and ketogenesis should be trigger in your body will lead to progress more and you will live longer as well as premature gray hair will be uh, occur later on their life but early premature gray hair is problem so it can be solved i hope you make sense about that as uh, a scientist don't know about the exact reason of the premature gray hair but the assumption can be possible and you can follow this assumption to get more and more darkening of your hair if you have less premature gray hair so the congratulations for those because you can reverse easily but if you have a lot of premature gray hair so you should be concerned with the health and you should uh, focus completely the diet and that will lead to it's okay and will be fine so it, it, it doesn't mean your premature gray hair means uh, your internal physiology is normal your internal physiology is disturbed which that will lead to premature gray hair so remember that thing your gut problem your nutrient absorption problem which that will lead to trigger the premature gray hair so remember that things i hope you make sense about that if you like my video please make sure to subscribe like and share see in the next video i am also making the handwritten tutorial about the biomedical science and the biology physiology biochemistry you can learn a lot of knowledge from that if you like that if you are a medical student or expert if you have any question you can email me or, give, uh, or comment below and you can ask the question for answer so i hope you make sense about that see in the next video for this one bye